Hi everyone, in today's class, I will explain you about variable concept in Java and also I will tell you what is scope and lifetime of a variable. Then what is variable? A variable is a named memory location which holds some value. The value stored in a variable can vary during the execution of the program. What is variable generally? The variable is a named memory location. Why? Because Without variable, we can't retrieve the data from the memory location. That is the reason it is a named memory location. Then what is the purpose to use the variable in programming to store some value, to store some data? Then how you can declare the variable in Java? The syntax is that data type, variable name, followed by semicolon. Or else, you can also initialize the variable while you are declaring data type, variable name, equal to initialization value. The example is also be given here. The int is a data type. The discount is a name of a variable. The 10 is the assigned value to a variable discount. This is a syntax has been used to declare a variable. See here, the simple example has been given to store a data in a variable. Here, discount is a variable. Then total price is a variable. Then price after discount is also be variable this is called expression to be evaluated after that then the price after discount variable has to be displayed clear how you can declare the variable see here in java it is necessary to declare a variable along with the data type before it can be used which means that when you are if you want to use the variable you must be declared Otherwise, it shows a compile compiler error, compile time error. Then I move on to the next slide. What is scope and lifetime of a variable? The scope is nothing but a simple a region or section of a program can the variable be accessed. When a variable declared within a block or within a section, the scope of the variable is only within the block which can't be accessed from the outside the block. That is the meaning of the statement. Then what is the lifetime of a variable? The lifetime of a variable is nothing but how long the variable stays alive in your memory. That is concept is called lifetime. Then the general conversation for a variable scope is it is accessible only within a block in which it is declared, which can't be accessed outside the block. The example is also be given I will explain with the help of the example. See here, then what is scope and lifetime of a variable? Here, in this example, int x, which has declared inside the main method, the scope of this x is up to here, which has been declared inside the method. Then what is the scope of the x? Then here up to this one. The here, the block, beginning of the inner block, the end of the block, the int y, y has been declared inside the block then what is the scope of the y only up to this one up to this block when block terminates the lifetime of the variable is also be gone the scope of the variable is within a block see here the y has been declared within the block but it is try to accessing from outside the class it shows error where the y has been declared it has been declared inside the block but here i am accessing the y from outside a block why equal to 200. Error. Why? Because y is not accessible in the outer block. Clear? I will show you the execution also. See here, difference between scope and lifetime of a variable. There are three types of the variable, instance variable, then class variable, local variable. If you declare the variable inside a class, which are called as the instance variable, if you declare a variable using the static keyword, which are called as the class variable. If you declare the variable within a method, which are called as the local variable. Now I have take I have given the example. It is related to the local variable because here it is a local variable. Okay, which is which is been declared inside the block or inside the method. If you declare here, it is, which are called as the instance variable. If you declare here by using the static keyword, which are called as class variable. Then what is the scope of the instance variable, class variable and local variable? The scope of the instance variable 
is throughout the class except in static methods. Then if you understand, if you know static keyword in Java, you can easily understand. Then scope of the class variable throughout the class. What is the scope of the local variable? Within a block in which it is declared. Just now I discussed about this local variable. Then what is the lifetime of an instance variable? Until the object is available in the memory. Okay, to access the instance variable of your class, we must create the object. Then what is the lifetime of your instance variable is until the object is available in the memory. And then what is class variable? Until end of the program. The class variables can alive in the memory until end of the program. Then what is the lifetime of your local variable? Until the control leaves the block in which it is declared. Which means that here when here when block terminates, the light from the variable is also be gone from the memory. Okay, that is the meaning of this statement. See here, simple example has been given. If you declare here, for example, int x, which is called as what? Instance variable. Okay, if you understand, if you know the class and object concept, then you can easily understand then what is instance variable and class variable. I will execute this program. See here, y equal to 1 because error as y is not accessible in the outer block because it has been declared inside the block, then where it has been declared inside the block which is not accessible outside the block. If any doubt regarding this variable and scope and lifetime of a variable, you can contact me at any time through the comment box. Thank you. Thank you all for watching my videos.